Welcome in to Dave Campbell's Texas Football Instant Recaps. UIL State Championships in Arlington. I'm Max Thompson. That's TCF Insider Matt Stepp. We just watched Mart put on a heck of a performance in a 76-33 win over Groover in the 2A Division II State Championship. And Matt... Just total domination. I mean, from start to finish, not a huge surprise. We expected this Mark team to really put on a show. Uh, everyone was back from that title team last year. But the, but to just do it on this level. 63 first-half points. They almost broke the scoring record in the first half. It was, it was pure and utter domination and for it, sure. Yeah, and look, we've seen this before. Mark's great in a lot of different ways. But today it was Tyra Horn maybe finally getting the due he deserves, right? I mean, he's always kind of been the guy in the middle. A lot of other guys get a lot of attention, rightfully so. Absolutely. Tyler Bailey, Elijah Green. But Tyra Horn. Maybe their best player and really showed it tonight. He's been their most consistent player the last three years, and he had a, uh, a definite grand finale in his right. senior year. Uh, 291 yards rushing, seven touchdowns. Just a sensational performance. And I, I thought the Mart defense was great as yeah. well. I mean, they, they gave up some big plays in the passing game, but forcing four turnovers really allowed them to get out to that big lead and, and turn this game into a laugher the whole second half. Groover, great season to this point, but everything pretty much went wrong with, for them right out of the gate, starting with the opening kickoff, the yeah, chasing it back and bringing it out of the end zone, and then just kind of one thing after another for their, for, for, from there for them. Uh, Jalen Conyers was probably the lone bright right, spot for I them. was going to say. He had 200 yards yeah. receiving and four touchdowns. Yeah. He was the bright spot, but their, their offense just – the turnovers just killed him, and it, yeah. it turned a game that was probably going to be lopsided into a complete laugher. Yeah. Uh, Mart, back-to-back state champions. No one's ever done that at Mart, which just seems surprising. They've I've, got a lot, yeah, of state got a lot of state titles. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but you know, it's like the question that comes after that is best Mart team ever. It's one of the. It's one of the best for sure. I think the '99 team with Quan Cros- Cosby that won a state title over Boyd, and then the 2000 team that lost to Salina in the state championship game uh, by four points in a classification higher. They probably have a case as well, but uh, from pure pound-for-pound pound domination, this is probably the uh, the best team uh, that Mart's ever seen. Uh, and, you know, from here, you say, well, we're gonna lose, they're going to lose all these guys next year, but Coach Kevin Offen has shown that he knows what he's doing now. He's, he's got everything in, in a row. Uh, are you worried about any drop-off from Mark going on from here? No. Roger <laughs> Freeman is back. He's a sophomore. Yeah. Uh, there's some young kids that played in the second yeah. half that showed some promise, and, and Mark's never been one to drop off. So I, I anticipate the uh, Panthers will be a force in 2A Division II once again in 2019. But we can totally expect Coach Hoffman to tell us at the beginning of the season. I'm not sure. Yeah. I'm not sure what we got this year. He's going to sandbag us again, I think. Congratulations to the Mart Panthers. Unbelievable performance. There's really not a lot else to say. This one was over very quickly, and it just shows how great they are. It's not a knock on Groover. Uh, Mart just simply one of the best teams in the state, bar none. Congratulations to the Panthers. 76-33 winners in the 2A Division II State Championship.